Hi guys and welcome back to another Tuesday 2 minute tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can create a customizable vignette in Photoshop. And I'm going to start right now. Right guys, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and choose a photo. And today I'm going to be choosing this photo which I got off of unsplash.com and I will leave the link in the description. So what we want to do today is to create a customizable vignette on this photo. So what we're going to do is firstly go down to our adjustment layers icon in the bottom right hand corner. We're going to click and we're going to go up to all the way where you can see it says gradient. So what we're going to do is we're going to choose the colors for our gradients. We're going to go and click on this icon and the gradient we want to choose today is the black and white. So it goes from black to white. So this is where we want to start changing the style and the size of the gradient to kind of customize it to how you'd like it on the photo. So what we're going to do is change the style of this from linear to radial. So go ahead and select the linear and we're going to drop down to where you can see it says radial and this will turn it into a circular gradient. But as you can see, currently it's in the middle but we want it around the exterior. So all we will need to do is simply just by pressing the reverse button just here, it will reverse the image so the black is on the outside instead of the inside. And then all you'll need to do now is just simply increase the size to how you would like it. Now as you can see it's completely covering the image and we can't see the image below. So all we'll need to do is just simply change the blending mode. We go to our bl uh, blending mode options here and the one we want to select today is multiply. And we'll go and select there like so. So if we do the before and after, and there we go guys. So that is how you can create a customizable gradient in Photoshop. 